What's up, YouTubers? Eric Garcia. Uh, today I'm gonna do a tile repair. I came and I found this. The guys extended this little plywood. You see this little piece of uh, wood? They extended out to. <coughs> I think they. Uh, I don't know what the fuck they did. But anyway, they put this plywood so they make. They have to put new rafters inside and attach them to the existing and extend it out and now they want me to tie you with existing so in order for you to do this repair you gotta have to know how to do tile okay you cannot just come and and out of nothing you know if you're a plumber or electrician or whoever you are if you're not a roofer please don't don't try it okay don't try it unless you have an idea because otherwise you're gonna make a mess but anyway for the guys that know a little bit about roofing here's this video okay first of all you have to clean up all the mess uh, please clean up okay don't be don't be dirty don't be uh, messy don't be a pig <laughs> don't be a uh, whatever you okay clean up Make sure that you can tuck your, uh, you can uh, tuck your, uh, your, your, how do you call this shit? Sorry, I'm thinking about something. Because it's going to rain and I have another job, you see? I call my guys and I tell them, you got to cover the house because right here it's sprinkling. So I tell them, I go ahead and cover the house and uh, while well, I do this little repair and these guys that are waiting for me, they put some plastic sheeting, but they, they don't know how to waterproof it, so they want me to at least uh, install the, the felt. And they want me to finish it today, so hopefully I can finish it. I'll finish it, it's a little fucking thing. You know, what's a lot for Eric Garcia? Nothing, right? Anyway, <laughs> just kidding. Anyway, guys, uh, uh, <clears throat> okay, today I'm gonna try to uh, show you how I do this repair, all right? So, here we go. First, you're going to do clean up, okay? Clean up. The edge metal, you know, I cleaned up over there, you see it? And then I cut the felt on the other side. So anyway, I'm going to put a bleeder. I hit it against the, along the valley in full roll. That overlaps about two feet on that side, two feet on that side. Then I'm going to put another layer on top of it. So I'm going to start with half. Before I'm going to throw my, I'm going to install my, my, my full roll along the valley, you see? These guys they did it different. I don't I don't like to leave it like that because sometimes the water goes underneath the felt and then it goes underneath. So to me it doesn't work. But if it works for you it works. So remember uh, metal and felt they go totally separate. Metal goes on top of felt, not felt goes on top of metal. You see it? I'm right here on the valley. Alright, so I'm gonna start with half and then I'm gonna continue like that. A piece of uh, felt, and then I tuck it underneath the, the one that came in the valley, but then I'll push it with my foot like this. Look. See it? All the way in as much as I can. See? And now I'm gonna put another little piece right here. And that's gonna help me to, to overlap all the way to the bottom. See, just put it in pieces, don't put a, book, a big piece because it's gonna cost you more. So, gonna give you a hard time. See, it? gonna give you a hard time. You're gonna, you're gonna have a hard time trying to deal with the big pieces. Put them in little pieces. Just make sure that one tucks, is tucked underneath this one, okay? Hmm. Put in the last layer. Actually, not the last because it is. Still need to have another half underneath the felt, but I'm putting it in pieces because I have to tuck it underneath the 40 pound felt. They use one layer of 40 pound, so you have to push it in like this. Make sure the paper is loose, you see I remove the nails. And I push with my, my foot, you see it? Push it up or down. See, I'm just following the the line right here. You see? So that's perfect. That's what I want it. And then later, I'm gonna put another one right here. Tuck it underneath, and then I'm gonna come back and put another half on top of it. Okay. 
My edge metal, my felt, tuck it underneath. On that side too, I patched it. Now I'm gonna uh, install my valley flashing. Valley metal, valley flashing, whatever you call it. I'm gonna tuck it underneath the existing, push it, and then cut it about one inch past the, uh, the edge metal so the water can drip in there. This is a tricky part, okay? This is the the old burr stuff. But right here they added on this this little extension, about two courses. But now I'm gonna have to put a new burr stop. So the burr stop, the tile that the course of the tile, the lines that they have to match with this. In order for you to install the burr stop perfectly, you're gonna have to I do this, okay, because I'm a tile guy. Okay, I don't I'm not inventing this from my this is what I do, okay? I align this one exactly where it belongs. You see it butt it to the old one and then I make a mark right here. I cut this piece straight with that and then this piece I'm just gonna start from the end over there and that's gonna continue the course, okay? So when you start your new course over there, it's gonna be the same as this one, all right? That's the only way you can do it, okay? Otherwise, you're gonna be running in circles. <clears throat> Believe me, it happened to me before, so you can't you can't do it another way. So you have to mark it, and then this piece, install it over there. This big piece, this little piece is the one that's gonna guide you how you're gonna start over there. Okay, all right? <clears throat> all my flashings, my burst up, everything, valleys. I'm gonna start uh, doing my my tile. First, I'm gonna do the course against the the skyline and then I'm going to continue this way with the uh, other courses and then at the end I'm gonna cut the tile right there so it looks straight and then I'm gonna do this and that one is coming from that side so I'm gonna have to finish here uh, it's not that hard so see how it comes out and then after I put all the new tiles and close the valleys, cut my things, change about 30 tiles on the field. The guys uh, who replaced the um, skylights, they broke tiles. Well, they don't know how to walk on it. Neither I am, so I break a lot of tiles too. But anyway, I try to, I know how to replace them. So uh, I installed these uh, skylights a while ago. And uh, these guys, they put the dome on it, the, the light, the, the, the glass on top of them, and they break them. So... Anyway, here it is. Hopefully, you like it. And if you like my channel, please subscribe. I'm not trying to get famous or anything, just trying to show the world what I know, share my knowledge a little bit. Thank you guys from around the world. Thank you very much. Sayo Nara. Adios.